Hello world, this is WhatsApp290 here and today I'm going to show you how to set a, an audio file, a being audio file, the file the iPhone can recognize as your uh, default ringtone or text message tone. Now first things first, if you're setting a ringtone you're going to want to make sure the audio clip, audio clip you're using is only is a maximum of 30 seconds long and if you're using a text message tone you're, you're going to want to make sure the audio clip is no more than like 10 seconds long roughly. And if, I've, I'll mention that if you have above i eleven, if you have uh, um, iTunes eleven or higher, you'll it's 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 much easier to use GarageBand to do this. So uh, f yeah, that's the way I'm going to show you. And also, you have to have iOS five point or later for this to work, I believe. So first things first, you're going to want to open GarageBand. Your laptop should have GarageBand. Uh, it will be on there if you install iLife, which I believe, which comes with all MacBook Pros. I believe it comes with the newer iMacs too, but I don't know about that, so not sure. So, what you're going to want to do with with this menu pops is you're going to want to start a new pro project. Click on iPhone Project. Go to Loops. And name it whatever you want. I'm just going to name it MC. Then click create. And you're going to want to silence all of these unless you want them playing along with your text, with your tone, I mean. And then you can. Uh, Put whatever sounds you want. You can create a, a ringtone and or a text tone using GarageBand if you want. But uh, I'm going to show you how to set. But to get in music on your off your laptop, you just click this button right here. Then that'll bring up all the songs that are in your iTunes library. But if you have the song on your if you have the file on your uh, desktop or something, you can just drag it in here. Then you want to drag it to the beginning. Did work. Did you want to turn this volume up? Probably. Uh, you can adjust the volume if you want. Uh, actually, sorry. What you want to do is, is make sure you drag it below these tracks. Because otherwise, it's going to try to add it as one of those instruments, and then you can adjust the volume. So there, and then what you're going to want to do is click on Share, click Send Ringtone to iTunes, and just give it a minute to process all this. Okay, so so then what you're going to want to do is uh, plug your iPhone in, go to it, and then click on Tones. Make sure you have, you can either select all tones, or you can just select the tones and select which ones you want, but uh, I'm just going to put all of them. So what you're going to want to do is, is click Sync. And that's about it. I'll switch over to a view of my iPhone so that you can see how to uh, set that up now.
Yeah, so once what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go to settings. And then you're going to want to go to um sorry. sounds. And then if you're setting a ringtone, and that you should be able to use that tone you uh, exported as both. But uh, it'll scroll down, and you can select the ringtone that you put into iTunes, or you can then you go select the text tone, and uh, yeah, the uh, if once you're in text tone, you have to scroll down to ringtones to get the custom one you made, and. Uh, then you'll just select it, which I have selected, right? Yeah, so you're done. That's about it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. If you have any questions, leave a comment. This is WhatsApp290, and I am signing off. Have a nice day.